My name is Ali, I'm a paper cutting artist, and I transform my hand cut paper cut artwork into laser cuttings and laser cut art. This is Light and Paper Studio, and I make things. I started out paper cutting just as a craft for fun, and I had so much fun with it and I really fell in love with it, so I just started to create more paper artwork, and I got into laser cutting as a way to be able to get my artwork out to more people um, and be able to create different items um, with the art that I do. I do each of my designs first as a hand cut piece with an X-Acto blade and a paper, and then I scan it, um, convert it on the computer, and, uh, and then send it off to the laser cutter to cut. One hand cut piece can take me up to 40 hours to create. It can take the laser cutting machine 20 minutes. One of my goals this year was to have kind of a community action or fundraiser. This is the original hand cut piece, but I have the laser cut reproductions. Um, and those are for sale and 10% of all those proceeds go to Planned Parenthood Toronto. And then I also created, um, using that design, a t-shirt design. Um, and 100% of the proceeds of that t-shirt go to Planned Parenthood in the US. I've already sold over 200 of them and raised uh, thousands of dollars for Planned Parenthood. I like to do all of my pieces by hand because that's how I started out. I didn't start out using a laser cutting machine, I started out doing all hand cut pieces. It has my own artistic aesthetic to it that you wouldn't get if I was doing it on the computer and having perfectly straight lines and perfectly done fonts. It's kind of gives it a different aesthetic and uh, all my stuff kind of looks more uniform within my brand. It was important for me to have a separate workspace just so that I could separate my home life from my work life. I used to be packaging items in front of the TV till midnight or working on paper cuttings at home at the kitchen table. Uh, now I do all my work at the studio. I don't bring work home with me and it's really improved my overall well-being in general. My dad has owned his own business and my mom works for herself as a psychotherapist. So it was huge having their support when I decided to to move this into full time. It was actually my dad's idea. To He encouraged me to create this into a business. This is where I put all my creative energy. This is where I put all my creative work. And I really work hard to create a really unique product. And, uh, and I take into account the things that people tell me that they want to see or the things that people are looking for, um, but then put my own unique spin onto it. I had never planned to have an artist business. I didn't go to art school. It wasn't a lifelong dream of mine, but it's become the only thing I can imagine doing.